And we move to Kaduna State, where the Minister of Defense, Abubakar Badaru, has delivered a resolute message promising that those responsible for the tragic killing of military personnel in Ukwama, Delta States, face or will face the full force of the law. He made this declaration on Thursday evening during his visit to officers and troops of the One Division Nigerian Army in Kaduna. TVC News, Lupe Asum has details. The Minister of Defense, Mohamed Badaru, was at the headquarters of the One Division Nigerian Army in Kaduna. He was there to interface with the division's troops responsible for maintaining the peace across various theaters of operations. His visit also comes on the heels of the tragic killing of 16 military personnel in Okwama Community Delta State. With unwavering determination, Minister Badaru pledged to ensure that the perpetrators are brought to justice. He also extended heartfelt condolences to the families of the fallen soldiers and the nation in mourning. Well, well, it's very, very sad incident. It's sad. You can see we are all on the move, on the mourning mood, and uh, we really uh, sympathize with the family, uh, the armed forces of Nigeria as well. And uh, indeed, it's a very, very, very sad development. Uh, What's going to be your reaction, sir? Well, those people will not be left unfurnished. We'll find them. Certainly, we'll find them and we'll furnish them. In addition to addressing the recent tragedy, Minister Badaru also received a briefing on the ongoing efforts to secure the release of 287 students abducted in Kuriga. Reaffirming the armed forces' commitment, he assured the public of intensified efforts to address security challenges. I am briefed fully well. The military, in coordination with other security agencies, are doing their best. And we are seeing uh, uh, the possibility of releasing them in sight. And uh, I'm sure we'll hear good news. The military promised to remain resolute in their task to safeguard the safety and security of the nation. Lupe Asom, TVC News, Kaduna.